born as Pranprim Manobal on March 27, 1997 in Buriram Province, Thailand. Her name was later changed to Lalisa, meaning the one being praised, on the advice of a fortune teller, in order to bring in prosperity. An only child, she was raised by her Thai mother and Swiss stepfather, who is a chef. Her stepfather, Marco Brischweiler, is a certified Swiss master chef and is a member of the World Chef Association. He runs a catering school in Bangkok and conducts food festivals and competitions worldwide. Lisa completed secondary education at Prafamantri School. Lisa is multilingual, she speaks fluent Thai, English, and Korean, along with basic Japanese and Chinese. She was interested in music and dancing from a young age. After enrolling in dance classes at the age of four, she began competing regularly in contests, including in To Be Number One, and joined the 11-member dance crew We Saw Cool alongside Bam Bam of Got7. In September 2009, the crew entered the LG Entertainment Million Dream Sanin World Competition broadcast on Channel 9 and won the Special Team Award. Lisa also participated as a school representative in the singing contest Top 3 Good Morals of Thailand, hosted by the Moral Promotion Center in early 2009, finishing as the runner-up. Lisa participated in the YG Entertainment auditions in Thailand at the age of 14. She gained an interest in the K-pop industry in her childhood, admiring artists such as Big Bang and 2NE1, and aspired to follow a similar path. Among the 4,000 applicants, she won the first place in the competition. At her audition, Lisa also impressed one of the judges, Danny M of 1TYM, who later praised her onstage confidence and her offstage attitude. She was invited to join an entertainment company as a trainee and moved to South Korea in 2011. Her parents encouraged her and supported her decision to relocate to South Korea at a tender age. She became the first non-Korean member of YG Entertainment. She trained with the company for five years till 2016. Lisa ran into many difficulties as she was moving to a foreign country by herself. Lisa couldn't speak Korean, so she ran into many problems when trying to communicate with other people. Thankfully, she met the other Blackpink members during her time as a trainee, and they helped her get through it. I have already explained in Jenny's video the trainee days they had to experience. In November 2013, she appeared in the music video for Labelmate tying single Ringa Linga as a background dancer alongside members of Labelmates and boy bands Icon and Winner. In March 2015, Lisa undertook her first modeling job for the streetwear brand Nona 9 On, followed by South Korean cosmetics brand Moonshot in 2016. She made her debut with the girl group, Blackpink, under the label of YG Entertainment in August 2016, when they released their first album titled Square One. The album included the songs Whistle and Bumbea, which peaked at number one on the Billboard World Digital Songs chart. She is the group's youngest member and worked her way up to become their lead rapper, vocalist, and dancer. Lisa became a permanent cast member on the Korea Army Academy edition of the MBC military variety program Real Man 300 from September 21, 2018, onward. Her first role on a television program since her debut, it earned her the unofficial Character of the Year Award at the 2018 MBC Entertainment Awards. On November 5, 2018, Lisa unveiled her YouTube channel, Lily Film Official, focusing on traveling, lifestyle, and dance. As of April 2023, she has 11.1 million subscribers. One of her dance performance videos went viral in 2020 as a result of a meme derived from the video, celebrities such as Dolly Parton, Stephen Colbert, James Corden, Luke Evans, and Lil Nas X participated in the trend. As well, when she appeared on Knowing Brothers she did a crab dance that went viral. Destiny Rogers' song Tomboy experienced a 1939% increase in daily streams on Spotify and entry into the iTunes and Apple Music charts of various countries following a dance performance video uploaded by Lisa to her YouTube channel. In March 2020, Lisa served as the dance mentor on Aichi's Chinese girl group survival program Youth With You Season 2. 
In February 2021, she returned as dance mentor in the show's third season for boy groups. Lisa's debut single album Lalisa and its lead single of the same name were released on September 10, 2021. The music video for Lalisa became the most viewed video by a soloist in 24 hours with 73.6 million views, breaking the record held by Taylor Swift's Me, featuring Brendan Urie, which received 65.2 million views in 24 hours, for which she earned two Guinness World Records. The song debuted at number 84 on the US Billboard Hot 100 and at number 2 on the Billboard Global 200, becoming Lisa's first top 10 song on the latter. The album sold 736,221 copies in South Korea in its first week, setting the record for the highest first-week sales among female artists domestically and making Lisa the first female soloist to surpass the 500,000 copy mark in one week. Lisa was praised by Thailand's Prime Minister, Prayut Chan-o-cha, for promoting Thai culture in her Lalisa music video. Due to the cultural references in Lalisa music video, it was reported that there was an increase in sales of traditional Thai costumes and accessories by local markets in the city of Bangkok. Money was sent to US contemporary hit radio as the album's second single, peaking at number 90 on the Hot 100 and number 10 on the Global 200, earning Lisa her second career entries on both charts and second top 10 entry on the latter. However, money came with controversies. She added braid extensions to her ponytail that seemed similar to box braids, an important part of African culture. The controversy grew heavier as groups with contrasting views relentlessly debated what it meant. A blink took her fan meet opportunity to educate her about the matter that went down in the Blackpink fandom and uploaded a recording for the fans. The rapper can be heard apologizing as she keeps on repeating that she had no bad intentions. She also said that she wasn't aware of the cultural significance and thought the hairstyle was cool, adding that she will be careful from now on. In October 2021, Lisa confirmed a collaboration with DJ Snake, Ozuna, and Megan Thee Stallion. Titled SG, the single featured songwriting and composition by Lisa and was released on October 22 alongside a music video. SG debuted at number 19 on the Global 200 and number 2 on the Bubbling Under Hot 100 chart and became her first number one song on the Latin Airplay chart. On August 28, 2022, Lisa won the MTV Video Music Award for Best K-Pop Video for La Lisa and became the first K-Pop solo artist to win an MTV Video Music Award. On November 13, she won the MTV Europe Music Award for Best K-Pop and became the first solo K-Pop artist in history to win an MTV Europe Music Award as well. Lisa was awarded two Guinness World Records in 2023 for her achievements, in addition to a third for becoming the most followed K-pop artist on Instagram. In April 2023, it was announced through Austin that Lisa would feature on Big Bang member tying second extended play, Down to Earth. The collaboration, titled Show Ong, was released on April 25th alongside a video in which Young and Lisa performed the song's choreography together. Due to her incredible talents, she built a huge fandom and she got a lot of endorsements. Through her work as a model for the South Korean cosmetics brand Moonshot, she became their brand ambassador in China in 2018. On July 25, 2019, Lisa became the brand ambassador and presenter for the new collection launched in Thailand, in which six of the products include her autograph as part of the packaging. On March 28, 2019, Lisa signed her first solo endorsement deal for AIS Thailand, the largest GSM mobile phone operator in Thailand. She became its highest paid brand presenter, and her advertising campaign was the highest rated commercial in Thailand. On May 11, 2019, Lisa began endorsing the Samsung Galaxy S10 in Thailand. Her first promotional material for the brand was released on May 14. Lisa also featured as an endorsement model for the mobile game Ragnarok M, Eternal Love, appearing as a character on their Midnight Party server beginning on July 24, 2019. In January 2020, Lisa joined labelmate Mino of boy band winner as an endorsement model for sportswear brand Adidas SS20 Season My Shelter Clothing Range. 
On June 27, Tencent Games announced Lisa as Supercell's newest spokesperson in China for their mobile video game Brawl Stars. In October 2020, Lauder-owned MAC Cosmetics named Lisa their newest global brand ambassador. She served as muse and face of many of their collections and key campaigns. In March 2022, she became the brand ambassador to whiskey brand Chivas Regal and starred in the I Rise, We Rise campaign. The huge influence of Lisa doesn't stop here. In January 2019, Lisa became the muse of Hedy Slimane, the artistic, creative and image director for French luxury fashion brand Celine. In September 2020, she was announced as global ambassador after having featured in their Essentials campaign, shot by Slimane, in June 2020. Lisa was officially selected as a brand ambassador for Bulgari, an Italian luxury fashion house, in July 2020, she participated in digital campaigns for their Serpenti and Zero One collections. That year, in November, clothing brand Pen Shop revealed Lisa as their newest ambassador. According to the 2021 Overseas Korean Wave Survey conducted by the Korean Ministry of Culture, Sports and Tourism and the Korea Foundation for International Cultural Exchange in 18 countries, Lisa was listed as one of the 20 most popular Korean singers abroad. In a 2021 survey conducted by British agency YouGov, Lisa was named one of the 20 most admired women in the world. Lisa's commercial influence and marketing potential have been noted by media outlets and cited as an example of changing promotional strategies in the fashion and makeup industries. Upon landing her first solo magazine cover shoot with Harper's Bazaar Thailand for their May 2019 issue, the magazine's distributor reported that all 120,000 printed and in-stock copies sold out. Generally, it is reported that 30k copies are printed, with well-known celebrities possibly having an average of 60k copies printed. However, despite selling 120k copies, the public's demand for Lisa was still not met. Following Lisa's appearance at and social media posts from the Celine Men's Spring-Summer 2020 collection fashion show in France during Paris Fashion Week, it was reported that global searches for Celine's Triumph bag leapt 66% on June 28, 2019. On April 10, 2023, researchers at Chiang Mai University named the Thai flower species Frisodialcia lilisi in Lisa's honor. Thank you for watching and see ya!